Yo, this little Tony, and this is not an interview. <laughs> I'm with Manny Supreme. Y'all boy tap in with my family. And I'm only asking my brother nine questions. All right, you ready? Let's get it started. First and foremost, how you feeling today, man? You good? You great. What about you, bro? Can't complain. Can't complain. All right, question number one. Again, shout out to everybody who's commented on our Instagram at hot1079ATL. If you want to see more artists like my brother, Lil Tony, make sure you guys comment down below and let us know who you want to see. But first question. Right, you started rapping at the age of 16, but what other rap names besides Lil Tony were you thinking about going with? Hey, it's crazy you say that. I'm, I was thinking, at first I had went with Tech, called my name Takai. I went with Tech, and it's like, my, 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 whole, my whole name is Takai Elijah Key, so it's like Tech. But, um, I'm thinking about changing my name to uh, T. Key. I don't like Lil Tony, kind of like, I feel like as if I'm, I'm getting older and bigger now, you feel me? I don't feel like I'm a little man no more, little boy no more. That's real. That's real. How do you think your fans going to feel about that, though? <laughs> man, um, man, I'll try to talk to him, man, man, where is that? I feel like it's going to be a little confusing at first, uh -huh. but it's just going to take time to really, like, set in, maybe like two, three months. That's real. That's real. All right, question number two. What is the best advice that your pops ever gave you? Man, shout out OG. He gave me hella great advice. Um, the best one is, I think, the one that resonated with me, resonate with me the most to this day, I say, it ain't about what you do, it's about how you do it. That's real. Question number three, what's a fun fact that your fans don't know about you? Um, I'm real spiritual. Uh, I'm, I'm nice. If you probably didn't you know what I'm saying? I'm, pretty, I'm really nice and I'm respectful, you know what I'm saying? Uh, to everybody. Real. Question number four. Now, we throw math questions in here once every so often. What is 18 about about two? Nah. Come on now, brother. My PCF family know about that money now. Come on now. All right, question number five. Besides hip hop and rap, what genre does Lil Tony listen to the most? It's crazy, bro. I don't know how to explain it. Uh, I listen to like frequency music, if that makes sense. Like, like no music, just no like, word. How would you say, you know, like kind of like gospel music, okay. but with that usher frequency. You know what I'm saying? Like holistic music. You know? okay. That's hard. What would you say was your first viral moment that stuck out to you? That is. Uh. <laughs> I think my first real, real viral moment that like had nothing to like, it's just a viral moment from a fan or like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like I'm, I'm, I'm rich now. <laughs> I think it would be the one where the nigga went to the Popeyes and shit. <laughs> I feel like that's my, my first real viral moment. Hey bro, you, you like Lil Tony. What? You like Lil Tony. Stop recording me. I don't even play like that. Fuck. I don't play like that either. You know what oh, yeah, shit. Name sustained. He like nigga. You look like Lil Tony. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> we got we got put that clip to there, man. When it when Brett said that, what was going through your head, like, bro? You man, I don't know. I was, he wasn't telling me shit. But when I watched the video, shit, that shit down so was funny. It made me like. What me. was your first thought when you seen the video? It, it made me it made me smile, bro, because it made it, it was it was cool. It made me smile because it was kind of cool, like to think about that my fans that people, like my name resonate with people like that. Like if you see somebody, you're like, nigga, that little tone, that's crazy. You know what I'm saying? That's all right. Okay, boom. What is someone who you haven't collabed with yet that you want to do, you know, use it with in the future? Um, me and Anissi ain't even get to do our collab man, for real. we gotta get, hey, Nene, I know you watching this, twin. Come on, man. Anissi, I, I love your music, so I love everything you stand for. I love your swag ass thing, so we got we definitely gotta uh, do one. So, but besides uh, Nisia, um, I say who really stand for something? I don't know. Let me see. A lot of niggas' names is tainted right now. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I say Nini, bro, cause I feel like she got. She just got that swag, so I really like, I like, I like, I like what she got going on. And she really the only one I be seeing and paying attention to besides, you know what I'm saying?
I'm saying? Everything else that just pop up, you feel me, on my Instagram, you would say. All right, Nina, you see that now. Let's go ahead and get that session in. Don't make me have to book the session, Twain. Let go. All right. Second to last question. Now, you know, uh, Money Music is one of my favorite songs. You know, it's one of the songs that begin in rotation here at Hot 107. Now, how long did it take you to record that song? You know what's crazy, bro? Nigga. I, I made that song in like 10 minutes, gang. Like, like. Bro. That song when I was making it, I I just was literally in there just having fun. Like, yeah. drop a dog, nigga, go kill him. I'm in there, I'm in there with all oh, Lil' Man Man. Yeah. Me and Lil' Man Man, we in there, we just having fun. Like, it was some hoes in there. And, and the hoes were blowing me. So, like, I was like, I'm finna make some hot shit. Like, man, fuck these hoes. I should like went in there, just got to tone my shit. Shout out to the hoes who were there. They know who they yeah, are. Yeah, we appreciate it. They, they probably, hey, matter of fact, that bitch, that bitch. That bitch was saying that the beat was elevator music before I rapped on it, on game. And that bitch blew up. Yeah, and I went in there and made a hit on that elevator ass music. You know who you is, bitch. <laughs> she probably listening to it as, 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 she, as she watching this. Now, last question. We are here in Atlanta again at Centennial Park. What is the best wing spot that Lil Tony takes time to go to in the A? Put me on. Yeah. Put me on. Put us on. Let me put you on. I ain't gonna lie, my brother. Shout out Loren. Loren PCF, man. Shout out my shouter, man. That my, that my brother. He put me on the sweet and fresh. Now, where is that? Bro, you ever been there? You, ain't never, you, you had sweet? That's that shit. Y'all boy go to sweet and fresh. I thought it was wings all rush. Shout out auntie. Y'all can go visit her, too. And we, Wings R Rush is him too, but I ain't gonna lie, Sweet and Fresh is better in my opinion. You like, go fuck with the Buffalo Lemon. That's what it's called. Buffalo Lemon gets you a green apple, green apple uh, lemonade. Yeah, they be tripping overly. Hey man, this was not an interview. We just took a walk through Centennial Park with my brother Lil Tony. You just kick shit. <laughs>